Welcome and thanks for watching. This is the third lobby of two old for fours and racers participating in this month's Viper Spec Series. This is the second week of the competition which has us running 20 laps at Road America. Randy pushes wide in the first turn allowing Leadhead, Phantomus and Bad Z to get by him. Surf tucks into fourth and by the time Randy gets back on the track he slips into fifth place with Nunderwoob on his tail and old Rusty Belly bringing up the rear. Surf gets loose coming off the rumble strip, allowing Randy to get by him down the back straight. Surf drives it in a little deep and ends up in the grass, allowing an underwood to gain a position. Back on track and running hard and looking to gain his position back. Nandra gets loose and pushes out, allowing Surf to take that position back. By the seventh lap, Phantomus has caught Leadhead and is pressuring him for the lead. Phantomus, a clan upper echelon driver, normally is placed in lobby one, but because of connection issues, this was the only room he could connect to. In order for Phantomus not to run away with the race, he graciously offered to jump into a stock Viper to run the race. Against the spec build Vipers, Phantomus really has to push the stock Viper to its and his limits to be competitive. It's agreed to have a competition caution at the halfway point of the race. And after lining up, Leadhead gets us started again. Trying to maintain an outside line, Surf catches the grass and loses two positions while Rusty Belly takes an inside line and gains two. Z, who's had a solid race so far, catches the grass and the wall, and by the time he gets it under control, he's in last place. of a battle going near the back of the pack as these guys pushing their cars to the edge which means they're a little bit out of control which leads to contact and a caution after everybody gets lined up Leadhead's leading us back off with just five laps to go in the race
good part of this race, Phantomus has really been pressuring Leadhead, trying to figure out a way around him or pressure him to make a mistake. And that was the mistake he was looking for. Mistake by Phantomus has him push off into the grass there. It allows Leadhead to close the gap between them. Leadhead comes in a little hot and taps the back of Phantomus, which allows the gap to widen and Phantomus to go on for the win. With a good solid run, Leadhead takes second. And Surf gets a podium finish with a nice run himself. Thanks again for watching. Be on the lookout for Sebring next week.